the Lord took me to Germany. He took me to Germany. And uh, in Germany, the Lord showed me tremendous sexual sin in Germany. And he also took me by the beaches of northern Germany. And the Lord took me into the land also. I could see a lot of sexual sin in the land of Germany. There is so much sexual sin in the land, including the dressing of the people of Germany. And the Lord then asked me to pronounce the dreadful judgment of the Lord over the nation of Germany. And when I obeyed the Lord and commanded the tremendous judgment of the Lord over the nation of Germany, then I saw, I saw a storm from the ocean and I saw it thin like that, the way the tornado thin and made its way towards the beaches of Germany. So I've seen the storm coming to Germany. And when the storm stormed the Germans, I see a lot of things damaged. I see a lot of people trying to remove things, property from the houses. They were hit by storm. Now, I have not seen so much storm in Germany, but this is now going to take place. A historic storm is going to storm and hit and strike the nation of Germany. The Lord Jehovah, the God of Israel, Jehovah Elion, he has spoken with me about the need for the nation of Germany to repent. If Germany does not repent, this will take place. I see a storm winding. I see a storm already tornadoing, pulling, a storm in the ocean, coming, a storm like a hurricane coming on Germany. Code Red Storm, and it's roaring through the Netherlands, Belgium, and Germany. So far, it has claimed at least six lives and wreaked havoc with transportation systems. The storm slammed into the Netherlands this morning. Video on social media showing hurricane force winds ripping roofs off buildings. Toppling over signs. Yeah, I got it. Yeah. 
and pushing over stacks of shipping containers like Lego blocks. Workers at a construction site had to scramble to safety when a crane cable snapped in the wind and the crane came crashing down. Winds gusting up to 140 kilometers an hour also catching pedestrians and cyclists off guard, sending them tumbling across sidewalks and roads. The storm wreaking havoc on all means of transportation. And in Germany, train service ground to a stop. Officials saying the winds made train travel too dangerous. Officials say at least three people were killed in the Netherlands and another three in Germany in storm-related accidents. Cleanup operations underway in Germany after the country and other parts of Europe received a battering from Storm Frederick. <laughs> an hour at least nine people have died including five in Germany as powerful winds topple trees blue trucks off the road and force the cancellation of hundreds of flights in the west of the country 41 people were injured in weather related traffic accidents the storm is causing travel chaos hundreds of flights were grounded and in Germany all long-distance rail services were suspended Power outages hit tens of thousands of people in Germany, Belgium and the Netherlands and roads were blocked by fallen trees and debris. Violent crosswinds meant the skills of pilots were tested to the max. A video has emerged online of what can only be described as something of an extreme landing in Dusseldorf. As we show you this pictures here, the plane is uh, well taking a pounding from the wind, lurching from side to side, looking like at one point it might even turn over. The pilot battles against the elements every step of the way there before finally touching down.
And when this does happen, Germany shall know in the world that the Lord, He is God, the Lord Jehovah, He is the eternal King. And apart from Him, there is no Savior. And that I am His servant. And that the Messiah is coming. And that this is the hour the nations should embrace repentance. And that the mouth of the Lord, for sure, yes, He has spoken with you.